It was Spencer Mango, a world team member and now a U.S. representative in the SISM World Military Championships. Uh, Spencer is a member of the U.S. military. How, how important is this competition for you to represent our country and, and American soldiers and, and other uh, service members? Uh, it's very important to me. Um, this is a chance to represent the United States at a military world championships. Um, get to represent all the soldiers overseas currently fighting for us or, you know, the guys back home. So, you know, it would be a great opportunity to go out there and uh, win a gold medal for the United States. Now, this will be your first SISM championship. So you joined the Army after college. And, um, you know, as, as a competition, a new one for you, are you excited about having another opportunity to show what you have and, and how the military has helped you as a wrestler? Uh, yes, definitely. I'm um, I'm always excited for a competition. You know, whether it's you know the New York AAC tournament or you know the military world championships. So uh, you know I'm um, very excited to get on the mat and you know I hopefully get to uh, get that last loss out of my head and you know keep moving forward. Uh, yeah, now you wrestled only a few weeks ago and right. taken fifth in the world championships, another shot at a medal, and and you're going to have to refocus quickly for this event. Uh, how how do you? Uh, Get back to where you're going to be at top-notch shape uh, just a few weeks after competing over in Tashkent. Um, doing things like today, uh, you know, not taking uh, that long off, getting back in the room, getting a nice sweat going, staying in shape, and, uh, you know, just keep moving forward. That, uh, that loss is in the past now. There's, there's nothing I can do about it. Now all I can do is just work towards the future. So Now, your military uh, team, the Army, is always very close. You're a big family, but at the SISMs, you're, you're in there with Marines and Navy guys and, right, right. and Air Force athletes. Uh, talk about the pride of, of all the different uh, branches coming together for this. Right, you know, uh, during the, the Armed Forces Championships, we're, you know, trying to rip each other's heads off, but now we get to work together, and, uh, you know, it's one team. We're the United States of America, and, um, you know, it's, it's kind of cool because, you know, we get to be friends and hang out with them, and, you know, be a, a one big team instead of, uh, you know, trying to compete against each other right now. But, you know, I'm looking forward to it and, you know, hopefully we do well. Now we're hosting. You're going to be wrestling on U.S. soil, right. on a U.S. military base. Will that be an advantage for you? Will you, will you feel like, hey, you know, this is our house? <laughs> right, I, I think so. Um, all, wrestling in front of a home, home crowd is always a, a big help. Um, you have all the fans cheering for you and, you know, all the support. You can feel it in the arena. So I'm, I'm thinking it'll be a huge advantage for us. And uh, what kind of things did you pick up from uh, the Worlds that, that you might, might help you even do better here? That you just got off a real big competition. Um, right, from the Worlds you learned to uh, just keep pushing forward. Um, you know, give it, give it your all every match. Don't overlook anybody and don't give anybody too much respect. Well, that's outstanding. Uh, congratulations on another opportunity and you know we're looking forward to seeing uh, you right back out there <laughs> <You know? laughs> <Thank you. laughs> I, mean, I mean this is one of those deals that it's it's part of your job but it's also right. part of your heart right, right. I, mean, right. I love doing it outstanding thanks Spence You're welcome.